New York is a hot, beloved global city, and everybody wants to know what makes New York tick. of the city of New York is dedicated to exploring the life of our five boroughs. We have the story of, I think, the greatest city, you know, of modern times. And we basically tell that story in a very open, eclectic, and creative way. The Museum of the City of New York is the only museum in New York City that looks at every aspect of New York City culture, from the visual arts, from theater, from fashion, politics and social issues. Contemporary art, historic art, anthropology, sociology, urban planning, any lens through which to understand the character of this great city. The great thing about the Museum of the City of New York is that visitors to New York and New Yorkers can learn about this place in a very tangible way. 2011 marked the 200th anniversary of the Commissioner's Plan of 1811. The exhibition's filled with wonderful artifacts, original documents, original photographs, prints, views of the city. The star of the show, of course, is the Commissioner's Plan itself. And that was the plan that laid out the street grid of Manhattan with the numbered streets and avenues, 12 avenues wide and 155 blocks long. The exhibition is phenomenal, it really shows how the island grew from really farmland into the vertical city it is today. Since the mission of the Museum of the City of New York is to explore the qualities that define New York, you really have to put finance right at the center of that. Capital of Capital tells 200 years worth of history of how New York's banks and New York City have been intertwined. It's the story of how New York became a global capital because of the presence of its banking sector here and how these two grew up together to really make New York a worldwide capital of capital. Today, the mission of the Museum of the City of New York is to connect the past, that history, with the present and also with the future. New York's greatness is based on its past as a seaport. In October 2011, the Museum of the City of New York stepped in to start operating the South Street Seaport Museum. We opened 16 galleries on three floors. They're intended to interweave the city and the sea and the neighborhood. The South Street Seaport Museum really celebrated the first few centuries of the city. You know, visitors can come and learn what made the city what it is. We have the Skirmahorn Row and the Bound and Company letterpress shop, where you can still go and see today how printing was done for almost 200 years. A big cornerstone of the mission is the education of school children, and there's not much stretch from the Seaport Museum to the mission of the Museum of the City of New York. We're not just urban planners, we're also architects. These are two types of buildings we have in our city. We think that the past can do a very good job of informing the present. Well, the museum for the last uh, few years has been under a, a meaningful, you know, almost $100 million, you know, renovation slash restoration. As we take roughly, you know, 1930s uh, neo-colonial style building into the 21st century. The renovation was put into three phases very intentionally. We have been renovating our building, providing collections access through digitization. Today, you know, viewers are so adept with computers and technology. We really want to incorporate the latest available in technology, archives, photographs, a costume collection. We offer these through our collections portal. They're available not just to visitors to the museum, but to uh, visitors around the world, as well as educators around the world. With our collections portal, we have scholarship, tremendous scope, and high-resolution photography. All of these things contribute to the survival of a collection. Doing two institutions 
it's really a great credit to the staff that it is managing and filling with great content of the Museum of the City of New York. The Museum of the City of New York. The Museum of the City of New York. Celebrates and interprets the city. Educating the public about its distinctive character. Especially its heritage. Of diversity. Opportunity. And perpetual transformation. <laughs>